Hello everyone, in today's video we're going to be taking a look at a response to a question where they're asking how you can change the scenario features. So the scenario features is, you know, if you come up to the main menu here and press start new game, you pick a scenario and you press load selected, you pick a side, you press enter scenario, that's this guy. That's the scenario features and realism options page and it tells you kind of what you have. Now what you'll notice here is I can't change any of these and now the reason we're doing that is because we're not in scenario editor mode. So if I wanted to, of course, I could come down here and press begin scenario, it would fire up the scenario. There's no scenario here. Now let's open up the same exact scenario, but this time what we're going to do is we're going to do it in the editor. So I'm going to come down to edit scenario, come down to test that, go ahead and press the button there, press enter scenario. Notice the box did not pop up. The reason the box did not pop up is because when you come up here now, you actually have the ability to go to the scenario and features settings. So you can go over here, it's going to yell at you and say, watch out for that, da, 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 da. But let's say I want to do detailed fire control. Let's say I want to do communication disruption, and I'm just going to press OK. Now, if I come up here now and save this, I've now made that the official version of this scenario. So if we were to go back to the start menu, go up to start new game, click on the test a button, hit load selected. You'll notice when I press enter scenario now that my options have changed because of the fact that I have changed the default settings. Enjoy.